Hey everybody, thanks for tuning in. In today's video, I'm gonna show you guys a quick practice drill that I'm calling Get Fresh, Stay Fresh. This is a 50 round practice drill that's broke down into four strings of fire. Uh, this drill covers all the basic fundamentals. Uh, it is good for the beginner level shooter on up. Uh, the idea of this drill is to get the most out of every single round fired. Uh, I cannot stand seeing people load their magazines to maximum capacity, blaze all those rounds on a target. When you get done, you have a nice little group, pile of empty brass, your ammo's gone, and you gain basically nothing from that, in my opinion. So the drill I'm going to be showing you guys today is broke down into four strings of fire on three separate targets. Now, the targets I'm using are X-Steel uh, C-Zone targets. Uh, if you don't have steel targets, you can do this on paper. If you're not, uh, if you can't use three different targets, you could do all this on one single target. Um, during each, or the beginning of each string of fire, I'm going to go from the holster, whether it be your competition holster, your carry holster, either is fine. If you're not, if you don't have a holster or you can't use one, just start from the, what some call the low ready position where your hands basically would meet if you was coming from a holster. Start from this position, when you're ready to fire, go out, bang. What we're focusing on here is good hits. We're not uh, so much worried about speed. I usually go about 50%, 50% uh, speed, maybe 75 toward the end. Uh, but the idea is to focus on good hits and, and uh, good tight groups on target. So let me get my earplugs in. I've got my magazines loaded up with 50 rounds of prime ammunition, 124 grain full metal jackets. Let me get my earplugs in, camera reposition, and I'll show you guys how we do it. Okay, our first string of fire, we're gonna need five rounds. We're gonna put five hits in the center of target number one. It's gonna be uh, five different draws, five different sight pictures, and five different first shots. So we're getting a whole lot of practice here for just five rounds. Here we go. I'm going to be using a timer, um, not really paying attention to the time. I'm just using the buzzer for my starting point since I am a competition shooter. You do not have to have a timer, just tell yourself when to go. Here we go. Good center hits. Bam. As you see there, five good A zone hits on target number one. All that practice, and it just took us five okay, shots. Our second string, we're going to do three headshots, one on each. So we draw, bang, 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 one headshot on each target, reholster, do it three times for a total of nine targets. Um, this is why I like using the C zone targets because you have a small headshot there. You have to really focus on that accuracy. If you can hit that head every single time, you'll have no trouble with uh, small plates, poppers, and so forth in the competition game. And you sure wouldn't have any trouble hitting a human torso dead center. So here we go. One headshot on each. Again, we're covering our draw, all the basics, and we're throwing in some target transition here as well. Here we go. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Nine shots, all hits, just the way we like it. <laughs> okay guys, now we're on for the third string. Trigger finger starting to get warmed up a little bit. This time we're gonna do Double taps on each target, so two, two, and two. We're gonna do that three times for a total of 18 rounds. Here we go. Camera is on, yes sir. Again, good center mass hits.
Targets look good, guns holstered. I like it. Okay, in this fourth and final string, we're gonna draw from the holster and put six shots on target. We're gonna do that on each for a total of 18 rounds. Some people uh, know this as the bill drill. Uh, this again covers all the basic fundamentals and helps you with recoil control, recoil manipulation, getting that gun back down on target, squeezing off that shot. Again, we're only going for 50 to 75% speeds to assure that we get those good, accurate hits. Here we go. 18 rounds in the gun. I'm gonna start on target number one. Six good center hits. About a fifth size group there. Target two. Good group there. I had one, uh, one round down about seven o'clock. Getting a little quick on the trigger. Need to slow that down just a little bit. Here we go. Let's have a good tight group on the last one. Final six rounds. <laughs> Gun is empty and holstered. I like it. Let's go take a look at them. I'm gonna take a quick look at the targets. There's target one. You see we got our windage uh, pretty much spot on. I need to slow down a little bit and uh, get my recoil manipulation timing down just a little bit better. Good head shots. Again on this one, pretty tight group right here. We had that one flyer off to the left, but pretty tight, probably five inch group there. All head shots. Head shots on this final one look real good. Center mass. Group looks real good there, probably a four inch group. One flyer off about 10 o'clock. Not bad for 10 yards. So there you have it guys, that's gonna conclude uh, my video on the Get Fresh, Stay Fresh practice drill. Uh, this drill is, is very, very valuable uh, in the sense of how much uh, practice you're getting, uh, how much fundamental practice you're getting with only 50 rounds of ammunition. Even though it looks like it's competition based here, uh, anything you do with a handgun is, is drawing from your holster, picking it up off the table, and putting rounds on target. It don't matter if it's a tactical situation, uh, sporting, uh, or competition. Uh, it's all about being able to um, perfect the fundamentals and put your rounds where you want them to go every single time and I think uh, go out and try this drill I think you'll really like it uh, you're getting the most out of every single round again it was only 50 rounds uh, it's good for short practice drills or you can do it multiple times uh, and 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 like I said the times uh, your timing how long it takes you to put those shots don't really matter what we're focusing on is the accuracy so run the drill once take a snapshot of of your groups run it again and see if you're if you're improving uh, once you get it mastered at a certain distance keep moving it on out we're at 10 yards here you can move it out 15 20 25 i'll guarantee you when you get on out to 20 25 those headshots are going to start getting tough but if you practice cover all those fundamentals squeeze that trigger like you're supposed to you'll find that you'll eventually be able to hit those shots every single time so that's going to wrap up this video like always uh, you guys check out my sponsors prime ammunition uh, you can use code prime gun time to get 10 percent off of their ammo they have everything from 22 long rifle all the way up anything you could need x steel targets go by their website check them out they've got the highest quality targets at the best price on the internet go check out their competitors i guarantee you'll be satisfied with what you can get from x steel targets so try this out leave me a comment below let me know what you think about this video let me know if you want to see more videos like this one going forward appreciate you guys watching y'all have a good one